Alright you guys, welcome back to once again another video on the channel. I want to show you guys how to get better mic settings because I was doing a live stream and I said let's get this live stream to 30 likes and it did. I'm going to now do a video about it and a lot of you guys wanted to know like what I use as my mic and what I use um, to make my mic sound better. And a lot of people already know what this software is called and I'm about to release my settings. But first, I'm going to tell you guys how to download and everything. So first, go to this website, vb-audio.com forward slash voice meter forward slash, or you can just go in the description below, which is a lot easier. So after you're on the website, just scroll down to where it says voice meter 1.0.7.3 um, or whatever last version you have, depending on when you're watching this video. But this should be the version. It's a DXE file and make sure you have it on your Windows PC and then press install. Um, since I already have it, I don't need to press install, um, but basically I pop up with this right here with this panel uh, full of buttons. <laughs> so I'm going to get you through the steps on how to basically work it. I'm going to first start off with the top part and I'm going to make my way you know, to the bottom. So the top part, hardware input, click on this one right here and make sure you select MME and whatever microphone you have. Now I have the Fifey microphone, which is the USB PNP audio device. Whatever microphone you have, you need to select it and make sure it's MME. Now after you're done with that, it should pop up with this audio like when you talk. After you're done with that, um, go to hardware output and also select the A1. Don't select A2 and if you accidentally select anything in A2, just remember that there's this remove device selection thing right here. Um, which will remove the A2, but yeah, go back to A1 and make sure you have MME headphones and whatever headphones or earbuds or Bluetooth headphones you use. Click whatever headphones you use and make sure it's MME for that one. It just basically means you can hear yourself every time you're trying to test out your microphone. Like every time I say hello, hello. All right, so now we're on the, I guess, middle part of the voice meter panel. And I'm gonna first start off with this. So this is the main thing that makes your mic sound a lot better and it kind of makes your mic sound deeper. Um, the way the way you hear me, this is my normal voice. I mean, I can't really tell the tell the difference, but you know, people were always saying that I use um, that I use a voice changer. But this is like my original voice. Uh, if you guys want to copy this, uh, you know, just remove the red down to here. And for the hardware input too, you don't need to mess with that. Uh, if you want to copy this down, like the bass, the medium, the high, you can copy that down. Uh, you don't have to mess with any of this right here. Same goes with this. Uh, this is only for you to test. So like if you want to test the way your microphone sounds, uh, then you can always mess with this. You know, after you're done with that, um, go to menu and save settings. And I'm going to uh, I'm going to put this as uh, ASMR mouth. Um, so, yeah, after you're done with that, just, you know, test it out and see how it does. OK, so now I'm going to go on to open broadcaster software, also known as OBS. And I'm going to basically show you guys how to set up your microphone using voice meter and open broadcaster software. Uh, I should stop saying that now. <laughs> so all you have to do is go to audio and devices and make sure you have mic auxiliary audio. Don't use your original microphone because that's not voice meter. Instead, select voice meter output VB audio voice meter. And you can just keep your desktop audio the same. Like you don't have to change that. But just remember the mic auxiliary audio, you got to put it as voice meter if you want your mic to sound like the voice meter settings and yeah that's about it guys uh if you guys enjoy this video make sure you guys like subscribe and uh yeah but before i end this video i really want to thank you guys so much for 3.5k subs i'm gonna do a pack review i'm releasing my new texture pack um in my next video so be sure to tune in for that and if you guys want the same mic that i have it was basically 30 dollars when i got it but they went up in prices well actually if you guys look right now um it's 31 dollars on this uh aliexpress but i got i got it from uh amazon so but if you guys want to get it from here then i'm gonna put the link in the description but yeah this is like the cheapest mic that i found and uh my friend gray uh he does high pixel he actually taught me how to use voice meters so i appreciate that gray if you're watching this video but um you know this is this is actually a good mic um you don't need to buy an expensive mic to make your mic sound better uh, because you know there's softwares out there there's like audacity and this to make your mic sound much cleaner that's just you saving a lot of money that's about it if you guys enjoyed make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and also tell me if your mic sound uh sounds better and if it doesn't then just you know say it doesn't and tell me why and i can help you out in the comments that's about it 
appreciate it and I'm out.